What's up, everybody? So, uh, new plugin, okay? Legacy UVs for Genesis 9. Uh, Genesis 3, 8, and 8.1. So basically, you can use the materials from any of your 3, 8s, and 8.1s in Genesis 9, okay? So we're going to go over this because I've been playing with it a bit. Little, uh, it's a little finicky. So let's go over it and see what we can do, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and load up a Genesis NAN. Go ahead and load up uh, one of them. Oh, I'm just going to load up Victoria and put up a uh, figure. And I'll be back in a second. Right, so we're back here. We've got this now. I'm going to add a tone mapper. Create a tone mapper. It's a front. It's a tone mapper. Okay. And let's just add this in. So she looks a little bit better right now. And let's, let's see what we can do. Right, so uh, it's not very straightforward, this, right? It says click, uh, I mean, the first bit is click your nine, go into this legacy UV, that's all fine. Click on anatomy, double click that, right? Totally fine. Go into material, double click that. That's fine. Legacy UV, start material. Good, we all good, we all good. Go into utilities and click the first one. This prepares the object, done. It says it's ready. All good so far, right? If I open this up, it shows you it's selected everything. We get to go, man. We get to go. Now we just got to choose. Do we want to take the materials from 3, 8, or 8.1? Okay. Uh, now, I haven't tried 3. I don't have many 3s. 8.1 I've tried. Nothing works. And there's a reason for that. But let's go with 8 for now. Right. So I'm going to click. Right. Now it's ready for 8. Right. You double click it. It's ready for 8. This over here is pretty cool. Basically, if you lose everything, you can just double click this one. Boom, and it selects what you need, and then you just got to select the, the geograph too. Right, so from there, a few of these work. Uh, if I go to figures, and I go to eight, uh, Mary, Mary from next door, Mary, hello Mary, this one works. This one's totally fine. This one good. This one good. Let it just, uh, let it just load, I'll be back. Mary, why aren't you working, Mary? So that, uh, I mean, it used to work a little better than that. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Victoria 9, Mary. There we go. Okay, so Mary is good. Mary, Mary is good. Uh, the one thing that doesn't work on Mary is her eyelashes. Okay, so if I click the eyelashes here, you've just got to go back into uh, any Gen 9, whatever, and where are you, Gen 9? Over here, materials, and put on the eyelashes from there. Okay, so that's fine. Now I've got Mary skin. Mary, hello Mary. Mary's good. There we go. That's an uh, an eight figure on Mary, and we're good to go, right? So let's let's go see uh, other characters. So I'm gonna click this one. It uh, get my Gen Nine. Double click this. Selects my things. I'm gonna check my geograph. Now other figures. Other figures from eight don't work. Uh, like if I take, uh, say, this one, and and I go into here, and I go into materials, and I drag, that does not work, okay? If I go into Sahil, and I grab her, and Sahil mat, and I put that on her, that does not work. Uh, there's multiple that don't work, and there is a reason for this. There is a reason for this. If I take Ainsley, Ainsley works fine. So, okay. So we've established some work, some do not work. Now, in the documentation, it says Genesis 9 and the geographs will also be selected in the C panel. Yes, readiness for the application. If you have fitted the atomical elements geograph to Genesis 9, that will be also prepared and then selected. Okay, I'm not going to go through all that stuff. But basically what it's saying is for a character that does not work, uh, let's take her. You need to load the figure. So we're going to load the figure. I'm going to load this quick. I'll be back. Right, so I got Sahil in here, she's an 8, and basically what it says here is the majority of Genesis 3, 8, and 8 point material presets for the main mesh are hierarchical interpreter material presets. The icons are marked H materials, which means they will not load directly into a different mesh, including Genesis 9. In order to make the mats compatible with Genesis 9, they must be saved as normal material presets. This is easily done by selecting the character, so Sahil, and going to... File, save as, and material preset, right? So now I'm going to give it a name of Sahil, okay? Save that, save all the presets out, and say accept, right? Now, once I've done that, 
Once you've done that and you know where you saved this out to, then you got to go to where it's saved, right? So it's your content library. It would be uh, DAS 3D. DAS 3D. Which ones do I go to? Oh, man. Um, probably that one. Documents. It's this one. Okay, so it's in here. And then it's in... Uh, God, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know <laughs> any of this, where any of this crap is. But what I do know is uh, materials, maybe base materials. No. Okay. So basically, what I do is I just see where I saved it. You know, if I say save as a material preset over here, I just take this uh, URL, I paste it into an explorer, and then I get uh, this file. Now, this file. I'll select my geo shell once again. So I'll go up to smart. I'll go up to all products. I'll click on here. I'll say utilities and I'll click this one because it selects everything for me. And then I'll just select my geograph for uh, by myself and I'll just drag the file on and boom. Okay. That works. That works. So that's what you have to do in order to get I would say most materials on. You would have to bring in your character, save as a preset, then go into uh, wherever you saved it. Uh, you know, some of you that are more savvy with DAS will know this a lot better. And then you, if not, you can just take the file and you can drag and drop the duff straight onto your character. So have everything selected, drag and drop it onto your character, and you'll have that all working. I suppose the biggest thing is now, let's see... Let's see if we can do that with an 8.1, okay? Because that's that's the ones that scare me the most. I mean, that looks pretty good. I mean, <laughs> you've got some wicked materials that you can start using. It's just a little bit convoluted. The process is not the greatest process I've ever seen. So let's do that with an 8.1. I'm going to load up an 8.1 and let's have a look at what we can do, what they do. I do be day about day. Right, so now we've got Billy. She's an 8.1 character from Du Jean Trois. Now, let's see what we can do here. First, we go to Billy. We say File save as material preset and let's call it billy billy 8.1 okay just so that we know what we're dealing with and we good yes save everything we good uh now check this out if i go back here to all products and i double click this and i forget to change it to 8.1 and i say right select everything take the geograph and remember i like to drag it in because i have no clue where it's saves it and at this point i'm too lazy but i drag and i drop the material and let's see what happens okay give me give me a second people okay so that texture's on everything worked and whatever but look everything is kind of screwed right it's, uh, it's kind of screwed so basically all we got to do here is we take <coughs> excuse me we take uh we can do this again this prepare Genesis 9. Uh, it'll say it's ready now. It'll take the geographs, whatever. And we can say 8.1. Boom. Right. So now we're good. Now we're good. And now what we can do is we can drag Billy. And she should work totally fine. Okay. And that's for the 8.1. So uh, why do I have titties on her head? Uh, something ain't... Uh, <laughs> something in right here uh but i think they do kind of say why it's happening in the documentation anyway i suppose at the end of the day it's kind of convoluted it's kind of a walk around they do say in the documentation you need to change a good couple of files and stuff and naming and and whatnot and then and then at least it's prepared for you but uh uh i don't know man i don't know it's not it's not the easiest. There we go. Oh, older, 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 older. Nope. Nope. No. Nope. Yeah, okay, that fixed that. So double clicking on the 8.1 UVs, it did fix a few little things. That's no it didn't. Something something ain't right. So, uh I mean that's a quick rundown. Look, I'm using it as if I just pulled it out the box. Uh so so it can give you all kind of a a taste on what what to expect from it so 8.8s are very easy to convert you can convert those no problem you save the presets that that kind of all works that's fine but this i don't know this this kind of doesn't work uh as good as it should um so maybe there's maybe there's something that i'm missing 
maybe there's something that I'm missing or maybe there's something I'm doing wrong and I'm, sure I'm more than positive there is because it wouldn't be looking like this. I wouldn't have tits on the eyes or anything. So there's something I'm doing that's not fully correct. Uh, so I'd, I'd have to check it out. I'd have to understand why it's not working and try and get that fixed somehow. I mean, that fixes the head when I click on that, but the rest doesn't. I mean, if I click on that, that fixes it. Uh, yeah. Okay, so eight, eight for the eight point one worked. <laughs> I don't understand what's going on. It did it work completely. Yeah, it worked. It worked fine. So I double clicked on the eight, and that worked. If I click on the eight point one, that messes it up. You can see here it kind of messes it up. So. I think it's maybe a little buggy, maybe not. Maybe I'm just doing it completely and utterly wrong. I mean, all these other things are easy to fix up. You can just go straight into your Genesis NAND, Genesis NAND. So I, I do like it. I think it's cool. I hope that, uh, I really do hope that Cayman Studios will, will just make this a little bit more user-friendly in the future. Hopefully they'll update. It feels like they kind of rushed it out to get it out there. It's an awesome idea. Obviously, it's something that we need. Uh, it's a cool plugin. So Cayman Studios, like it would be great if you could just polish this off, make it work nicely. Uh, and maybe like for morons like myself, just make it a little bit more user friendly. That's it. A little bit more user friendly. And I think that just needs a little bit more time in the oven. But otherwise, it does exactly what it says. And it's pretty cool. Like uh, this, I would, this I would use. This is, this is awesome. Uh, you just need it to work nice. Yes, Victoria Ash. So that's the nice thing. I mean, you can go with Genesis 9 eyes and you can go with uh, Genesis 8 bodies and things like this. And, and it's it's quite cool. And everything seems to kind of work with the materials of Billy. So Billy worked. And that's pretty damn cool, man. So this is quite exciting. I mean, you've got all your materials for 8, 8.1 and whatever uh, threes and you can start using them for your gen nine so this opens up everything a hell of a lot more now yeah so that's that's pretty cool and they look damn fine they look really good damn they look great so uh blue chantoy makes really good textures and materials so uh they're pretty cool so anyway i hope that helps it's a it's a very basic introduction it's it's from a very noob kind of a way in just seeing if we can use it how easy it is to use out of there what it does and I hope this helps and thanks for watching guys. Bye guys.